Good morning, afternoon, or whatever time of day it is. This is a video that uh, I don't know the title of because she planned it, but uh, yeah, it's a video. Today we're going to be looking at backpacking, camping, hiking fails. So I have ranted on and on and on to you about this trend in specifically hiking and outdoor YouTube videos where they have an absurd title like these five camping mistakes will get you killed or you're using your gear wrong. And then like the host of the channel takes a picture making just the most ugly face possible and then puts in the background this blurry obscure image with different subtitles like no stop don't wrong. So real quick, let's get our thumbnail image. Um, but yeah, I've just described clickbait to you, mm -hmm. but there's just this ongoing trend of, you know, this is a fail, you're doing it wrong, whatever. So today I have compiled in a little folder for your viewing, the top like 11 images, I couldn't just stop at 10, that come up when you search hiking fail, camping fail, backpacking mm -hmm. fail. So we're going to take a look at some of those images today and uh, just kind of poke fun at, maybe get a laugh out of this kind of trend that I'm sure is not going away anytime soon, and maybe even make a case for why some of these are not in fact fails, mm -hmm. but backpacking wins, maybe. Ready? No. If you have the Donner Party in there, I'm just gonna say fail. This first image is one that I am sure you have seen. It's a pretty popular one that's from like two or so years ago. But it says, my sister said she was going hiking. This is our backyard. I could actually do a couple pictures like this uh, with our wood line and pretend that I'm hiking or backpacking. Nature is the ultimate healer to all our problems. <laughs> nature lovers. What if your problem is a tree falling in your house? Is nature... Can you know what? It made you into a minimalist. It taught you that you did not need all of these extra things in your life. I think that's a more interesting game. <laughs> I go through and name natural disasters and you justify why it's nature healing. Why it's healing. Yes. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Ideas for next time. And our next image. That is the first submersible tent I've seen. Yes. It's, it's impressive. It's a submarine tent. They planned this because uh this is the kind of person who, before they left, they're like, I've always wanted a waterbed. <laughs> I can't afford one in the house, but... If we walk out a couple miles, mm -hmm. I might be able to live my dream. Like, what do you do at that point? If you're not drowning and it's just like, just like up to your shoulders, you probably just go to sleep. I guess you like walk out on this rock and just like contemplate the decisions in your life that brought you to this point. I can tell you the one thing you can't do. Okay. Start your morning campfire. This is rough. I mean... I call that a win. You call that a win? Great story. Number three. <laughs> that is the face of a dad who was like, we are getting out as a family today, and this little toddler is not going to mess this up for it. Like, he will stop at nothing to have a fun family day. Or, I could see it being uh, the wife and family want to go hiking, and they don't have like a baby backpack and they're uh -huh. like, well, they can walk most of the way. It's like, there's no way he, that can, he can walk, walk. the whole way. Halfway through, he's like, I told you. And now I've just got to like- He's got to carry the baby. It's dad stuff time. <laughs> you can probably put a water bottle down like in the little back of, back of, the, uh, back of the baby's- uh, Overalls. Overalls. Where you have your water bottles on hand, you know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is it- I'm sorry, I'm looking close because I'm trying to figure out. It's not a romper, it's just a dress. No, it's like one of those, I don't know how, it's a club dress, essentially. What's the uh, the mountain that people go to to have like parties that you, you camped at along there? Which one? Oh man, yeah, this is the kind of stuff you'd see at Black Falls though. This could be like East Coast Burning Man. Yes. Okay. Which, according to the All Trails reviews, that's just Yona Mountain every day of the week. Can you see what the girl in front of her is wearing? It looks like yeah, like she's jean wearing just or... like jean shorts and a tank top. So I'm gonna call this one a friendship fail. These girls were gonna get together to hang out or whatever, and they told her, "Oh yeah, look cute. We'll come pick you up." Man, they got three quarters of the way through the drive before they told her they were going to the national park. It was too late. She could not go home and change. So she may do with with the situation her friends put her into. We're, we're going on a day, uh, day hike tomorrow. Wear something, you know, light and breathable. And cute. Club dress. Club dress. 
I will say, I do backpack in a dress and it is very just conducive to hiking in general, but it, it does not look like this. Hey, they're going for like a, a photo op. Are you kidding? They've gotta be. But here's the thing, if you're gonna do, here's a little tip and trick for you Instagram hiking models out there. You take a bag with you mm -hmm. and you put your change of clothes into that bag and you wear your, your oh. clothing that is conducive to hiking all the way up to the destination. Then you change in the bushes, take your little photo op, and then you change back into your hiking clothes. That's how you do it, guys. Yeah. Okay, so here's here's our next one. And I'm pretty sure that's my sleeping bag. Dude stole your sleeping bag? Yeah, dude stole my sleep. No, I'm saying like I, I'm pretty sure that's a mountain hardware sleeping bag that he's using. Which right. it doesn't matter because I have a men's backpack. So use what works for you. But this guy, okay. some things were not thought out. This is a lose win lose. Okay. I'll explain. All right. This man went camping. Mm -hmm. um, he had he thought he needed everything. He realized he can't can't sleep on the ground because it's too uncomfortable. He didn't have like any pad pad. Lose. Okay. He constructed a thing where he can <laughs> suspend his entire body, <laughs> and I've been there. Okay. That's okay. a win. Uh, but he probably could have found something to go under his head because when he wakes up, that's going to be a neck lose. Yeah, that's going to be painful. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, he's trying his best. Maybe the reason he's sleeping outside the car and without a tent set up is because that water bottle didn't have water in it before. I don't get it. I'm not going to quote the song exactly. But oh. That was, that was Grey Goose Baby. Oh no! <laughs> I, could, I could see a, a guy out uh, by the campfire and everybody else has got their tent set up and he just started the party a little too early. And oh no! So he constructed his bed out of what was at hand. <laughs> I mean, Here, so you don't have to keep leaning forward, let me. Yeah. I mean, they got a win here by having a little toilet paper holder. That's that pretty ingenious. Is? Yeah, they have some kind of like, um, I don't know, bent rod that they've set their toilet paper on. I'm curious as to, this is not a tent. This is just a blue wall. Oh, this bathroom. is a privacy thing? This is just for the bathroom, yeah. Oh, wow. Um, and I'm guessing, based on the fact that they had this set up, and had all that time to do that. that. That either go there frequently or this is on somebody's property. Or this is like, you know what? I bet that we're, somebody is gonna say we're total idiots and be like, how can you not recognize the privy on the PCT on this part of the trail? I'm wondering what that is, but. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's like a, it could, could be an in use flag. What if it's like laying down? Oh my gosh, kind of like how they have the bear cable that you pull. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh, but there's a, hey, somebody's using this, don't walk behind the little blue privacy tarp. Oh, even more win. If we're correct, and this is an entire, not just a toilet seat, but an entire toilet <laughs> in those rocks, that is a privacy tarp, uh -huh. that's a toilet paper holder, and that's an in-use flag. And it goes down far enough to be its own like composting toilet system. This, this is, is a major win. Incredible genius. All right, next up. Okay. <laughs> Let me, do you want context or do you already know the context? Um, I'm guessing that's talking about the pants being breathable. Yes. And some, but it's... every single time on AliExpress, women's pants, men's pants, anytime it is athletic pants, they use this image to demonstrate that it is breathable, but instead it just looks like it's conducive to passing gas. Is this kind of like the, the Wilhelm scream of advertising pictures where like somebody did it at one point and it became everybody does it because it's either funny or they're paying tribute to it i don't know i can't imagine we're almost done don't worry this poor dog, <laughs> this poor dog. he's struggling this he is, is the driver of the struggle bus this is entirely something you would do if i didn't talk you out of it yeah that poor dog that's a that's a fail that is a fail, actually. Absolutely a fail, yeah. Aww. One time, uh, I saw, it was just like a day hiking family, but they had this big fluffy husky, and he was wearing like the full boots all the way up like half of his leg, and the fur was just like puffing out of these tiny little rubber boots, and he was doing like tiny little steps everywhere. He was having a really bad day. Yeah. Uh, for one, for one, this area is so overgrown. It like looks like our backyard. 
this, you know what? His wife probably kicked him out of the house for not mowing the daggum yard for the 80th time. Clarify something for me. Okay. I thought at first looking at it that that is a fake fire on the TV. He's playing a video game actually. Oh! In which case this is kind of a win. Probably gasoline for a generator. Okay. And this makes got plenty of sense. A cooler, probably some snacks, some things like that. It looks like he's holding something that could be a controller. Okay, he's got his little tent. Okay, so this man has brought his gaming system out into nature with him. Depending on where this is take, when this was taken, this is either a fail or a win, based on if he had to have that kind of TV that weighs like 50 pounds or not. Yeah. <laughs> if he didn't have to have it, that's still, uh, still kind of fatal, actually. Because if you lugged like a 50 pound TV out there to play video games... This man is car house, camping. There is no way he even carried like a tent that big for just himself. There's no way that he carried that out to an actual campsite that's not car camping. There's no way. You know, he kind of... Oh, he kind of looks like Timmy from Why Does Kids You Know. I was going to say that. <laughs> I've been thinking that the whole time. He looks like Timmy. So is this... These are like hiking sandals, but he's got wool toe socks. Seems like he's probably comfy. I mean, this is one of those things where people get really uh, heated and opinionated over your footwear. Uh, there are some people out there who are just diehard. If it's not boots, it you know you're doing it wrong. If this guy's happy, you know. Do what you're gonna do. I told you about that Table Rock uh, hike or trail race years ago. They still do it every year. Um, but there was the one year that this kid, he, he was like 20 something years old and he ran the entire thing uh, in 45 minutes wearing nothing but like 70s uh, basketball shorts and chacos. And this kid just like flew up the mountain and down the other side in 45 minutes flat. If it works for you, I mean... It definitely looks strange. But it looks comf strange. But if it's comfy, then, you know. That brings us to our last one. And I don't remember what it is, but here we go. I mean, they were, they were probably on a like a, on an actual hike and hiking through a place. and. Yeah, this is a through hiker taking a zero day when nothing goes their way. There could be another context for setting up the tent on the bed, though. Oh, like bed bugs? Like it's a really nasty Depending place. on how sketchy that motel looked, this could be pure genius. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. With the no see mesh, they're like, nothing is nothing is getting at me I'm tonight. not touching those sheets. I'm not touching those pillows. Though it looks like they have the pillows in there. Kind of kind of doubt they hiked out with those. The hotel room looks dated, but not super sketchy. So I wouldn't, you know, unless they had like just like straight up stains of various unsavory <laughs> colors on the... <laughs> On the sheets. There's a little bit of mystery a everywhere. A little bit of mystery. Yeah, this is this is either a through hiker zero day in town, or this is a couple that was determined to go camping this weekend, and they are not going to let, not even nature itself was going to stop them from using this gear they dropped all this money on for this weekend. There's one far sketchier explanation for <laughs> oh, this, though. What? Um, this is a... I'm hoping that's not the case. Me too. <laughs> Extreme links for infidelity. Thanks so much for joining me today. And thank you so much for watching. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed some of these silly pictures that, again, just came up with a search for hiking fail, backpacking fail, camping fail. Uh, let me know if you've seen any particularly ridiculous fails or if you have actual context not just the make-believe stories we made up for some of these things uh to clarify it was a long hike from that end of the kitchen table to this one mm -hmm. but you did it but i made it you did it and i did it for for maybe, love however many people are watching the video and you yeah. probably like a hundred these don't get a lot of views but but when they do it's the people who are in it for the long haul all right, but in all seriousness, uh, hope you have a great rest of your day, and I can't wait to see you again next time. Tracing my footsteps through the wind Back to a place where I could begin Where do I go? Where do I go? And if we carry on my Just don't know where to go
just don't go hiking. No, that's not an option.